Hi, everybody. It is January 2nd, 26, uh, 2018. I posted this video last night. There are a lot of comments below from subscribers, and they leave in good comments regarding what they take to feel better. So I was going to read some of these comments. I can't. I feel like I'm now coming down with something. Just spoke to a friend. I canceled. I'm visiting with her, and she told me that oh, there's some kind of virus or something going around this area. I don't know. Maybe with everything that I'm taking, maybe I've just kind of staved it off or something. But yeah. But I don't want to wait on this because there are a lot of you who are really suffering physically. So I wanted to bring your attention to the chemtrail detox. I will link below to these videos that I'm going to be showing you about borax. I got a comment from a subscriber, I don't know, two weeks ago. He said, thank you for mentioning borax. He's been using it for two days and he feels so much better. In two days, he feels so much better. Okay. I've been um, taking borax. Borax is a, don't get scared by detergent booster and it, it's sold in virtually every supermarket, so you won't have any problem finding it. It's not that expensive. I think it was five fifty here in South Carolina. It's a mineral. It's sodium tetraborate. It's like a salt of um, boric acid. Sorry, my brain is really kind of leaving me. Anyway, I've been taking a ha um, an eighth of a teaspoon in the morning, eighth of a teaspoon at night. Now, I read a comment from a subscriber, Stormy Days, who said that she has taken one and a half teaspoons of borax and said it was amazing. Here, one and a half teaspoons of borax in a large glass of water daily. For a month and it was amazing. Okay, so when I have subscribers saying something is amazing, uh, thanking me for just mentioning it, he taking it for two days and he feels better, okay. Um, but understand this, we're all different. Everybody's different. So um, the other things that I take, magnesium and potassium aspirate, aspartate that is supposed to lessen pain warm wood turmeric that's supposed to lessen pain people having difficulty sleeping take melatonin I still the the one thing that I always do is eat raw garlic and black walnut tea has come up in the comments, activated charcoal, zeolites, iodine, spirulina, bentonite, bentonite clay. I've been taking hot baths with bentonite clay. That's another form of detox. I've been drinking charcoal, not the capsules, but the powder, putting it in water and drinking it. So, again, you know, I may not really be doing all that well. And I can, sorry for the noise. So I can take a lot of different things and yeah, all right. Well, we're all different circumstances, stress, you know, levels. Um, we're at war. If this was an easy fix, man, well, they'd be losing the war, right? Well, it's not an easy fix. And what works for one person may not work for another person. Somebody left a comment asking about um, Organite and Chemtrail Busters. You know, some people swear by that stuff. If it works for you, hell, even if it has a placebo effect, does it matter? No, you'll be feeling better. So try it. That's That's the only thing that I can say. Try it. 
The other video was Wexford Kinesiologist Reveals Shocking Health Implications of the Global Chemtrail Program. I want to thank the subscriber who left this link below that video that I posted last night. At 36 minutes in, they talk about solutions. Collodial silver is one that people swear by. It, it Look, a lot of this stuff is expensive, and you can't buy the Walmart stuff, okay? You really do need to buy uh, the, the minerals, the supplements, the vitamins from some natural food store that sells the products that you will benefit from. You're not going to benefit from the stuff that's sold at Walmart. And that is unfortunate because, yeah, the good stuff is expensive, and I know that a lot of people can't afford it anymore. I mean, in this video, they're talking about get a reverse osmosis system. How many people can afford that now? Water purification systems. It's very, very difficult. Um, I drink distilled water. I know. I'll get comments, oh my god, you're drinking distilled water. That doesn't have any minerals in it. And then there's, you know, people who swear by distilled water. So you have a lot of conflicting information out there. Um, you know, purified water may work for one. Distilled water works for another. The, the, I think the bottom line here is that you should know who you are. Know your own physicality. Stop going to doctors because they're just going to kill you. Um, they're... They're schmucks at this point. What? They go, they spend an enormous amount of money to get fed lies. And then, hey, I get to wear a white coat and, and have the most just disgusting arrogance drip from me because I'm God and my patients better listen to me because they don't know themselves. I know. So you talk to them about the electromagnetic Microwave frequencies were saturated, and they look at you like you're crazy. You talk to them about the aerosol spraying, you're crazy. You talk to them about the genetically modified organisms in our food, and, oh, well, it's fine. You know, that, that the food is still the same. Jesus. All right, so medical doctors are really morons today. They have no clue what they are doing. I'm not saying that every doctor, but... On the whole, our medical system, it's an institution corrupted by Big Pharma, by, oh, greedy, 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 I want more money, I want more money. Oh, well, what does that mean? Okay, I got to do harm. I have to speak that oath, do no harm, but then when I'm practicing, I got to do harm because that means my patients will be coming back to me and I'll make more money. And that's the way we roll here in the U.S. of A. So, yeah, um, borax. Try it. Uh, I would start out with an eighth of a teaspoon. You might want to work your way up to one and a half teaspoons. But if anybody knows that one and a half teaspoons is absolutely safe, leave a comment, please. All right, guys. I hope uh, you guys are feeling better. I hope those who are feeling well, you stay that way. And I have some guy looking at my car. So I'm going outside to see what's going on.